Hello YouTube, today I'm going to show you how to make a very simple notepad because a whole lot of people have been asking me how to make one so it's like the simplest thing you could ever make in Visual Basic so it's very easy so open it up, create a new thing Okay, um, I'm just gonna make my notepad uh, this size. Um, I would show you how to make it all nice and graphic and all, and, but I don't want to. Because that'll take a long time. Alright, just give it your name, obviously. Alright, whatever. So, I'm just gonna leave it like this, the default settings and all that. I'm not gonna customize it. Okay, so what you do is add a text. Um, first, let's go ahead and go add a tools tree menu or something like that. A menu bar, I think that's what it's called. A menu strip. Yeah, go add it right there and add a text box like that. Make a multi line. Okay. Now anchor it so it will work. It will um, resize when you resize the form like that. Enter. Now get your tool strip bar. Type in file. Right there. Go right. Just type. Um. let's just put exit right now I don't remember the code so you can save it on open but yeah I don't feel like it just put edit right here and right there copy paste cut and what was it copy paste uh, I think that's it yeah on file um, let me move this down or I don't know if I can I'm gonna put new enter I don't know if I can move this yeah okay now now let's just go to the coding on new double click on that right there type in text box one uh, oops. Text. I oh, here it is. Text box one. Dot text equals, and then put this and this, and then um, for the exit, just put application. Dot exit. Okay. Now on the edit, copy. Double click on that. Put text box one dot copy see how simple this is um, oops oh, what I mess up on um, text box one die what is this for paste and text box oops oh, text box one die cut so yeah let's see how simple this is and I would show you how to change the folder and uh, what the fuck the color of the text and all that but nah uh, sometimes when you make notepads like this on the the text on here it comes out small if you don't want it small go right here to the size um oops not right there I should say font make expand that right there size just let's just put it 11 enter and if you want a bold or whatever but yeah you can add those in other buttons like let's just add a button I'll just name it bold this is just an example of what you can do um, so pretty much everything that's on the side here you can change it with one button so like if you want it bold 
we're gonna make it so when you click that button the text on the text box will be bold so put text box one dot text dot um, mm, I'm sure there's a way I just don't know it right now equals no You know what? I don't know. Let's just forget about this. I don't wanna. I don't wanna make it a long tutorial because I can't find that out right now. So yeah, I don't want. No, let's just delete that. I don't want it. All right. So let's just debug this thing. All right. I didn't mess up on anything. It actually looks pretty nice. And see how when you resize it, the text box resizes with the form too like that so just put I don't know this just capitalized because I have cap locks on oops uh, whatever like that you can see how it's bigger now you can go to a new it'll, ma it'll make a new one type something else edit copy edit paste Oops, what is that? Well, you have to highlight it. So if you highlight it, edit, copy, edit, paste, there it is. And if you select part of it and then cut, it'll cut that. Yeah, all of it works. You can maximize it, whatever you want, it works. It actually came out looking pretty nice. Alright, so that's how you make a simple, simple notepad and, uh, Visual Basic. Um, so yeah, you can make a notepad. If you really work on it and all, you can make a notepad that looks just like mine. You can move it with its own border. All these options. Oh, I forgot about the select all and clear. I just put text box one dot select all. Text box one dot undo. You know. You can even make it talk. Whatever you write here. So yeah. Um, maybe if you guys want to learn how to make a very advanced notepad, comment on this video and I will have the, note, the video, but on my website on the tutorials tab because I don't want it on YouTube because it'll be too long, maybe, I don't know. But yeah, alright, bye.